Nice. I have a hard job. Nice. <laughs> um, hey guys, uh, my name is Eric from ReliableResellers.net. Uh, thanks a lot for coming back to another video. Today is Monday, July 26th, and we are going to a comic book store because I need to get some bags and boards for the uh, comic books that we're going to take back out to the, two and three quarter to miles. the auction Turn left house. On I two seventy five south. A lot. I have um, a box of books that I've been just sort of uh, adding to over the past couple of years, and it's some older books, but they're not bagged and boarded, so I need to get some bags and boards for them. So we're going to drive over here to uh, Green Shift Comics and buy some bags and boards. I called them ahead of time just to make sure that they have them, and they do. So perfect. This afternoon at 3.30, we're going to go and buy, potentially buy, another toy collection. So I'll bring you guys with me uh, to go do that, and uh, we'll, we'll check that out. Um, other than that, I don't have a ton going on today. Uh, da -da 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 -da. It's Monday, you know, again, <clears throat> Sundays and Mondays for me, I, I, I do just kind of chill a little bit. I tend to not work a ton. Um, so uh, anyway, let's go over here to Green Shift. Let's get some bags and boards. This afternoon, in a couple of hours, I'll take you guys with me and we'll go buy, potentially buy, <laughs> a, uh, a toy collection. So uh, let's go do this. get some bags and boards all right got the bags and we got some boards let's go get our comic books bagged and boarded at least the uh, the ones that aren't so we can get them ready for the auction so here's this box of comic books um you know there's a here's a there's a quarter book a quarter books so i just need to get these bagged and boarded so I can take them up to the auction house. So we're gonna take the bags and boards here and get these things done up. Ooh, that one's ripped this one the cover. So let's do this.
All right, so here's a bunch of like quarter books. It's a couple of uh, like 20 cent books in here, 10 cent books somewhere. It's like there's a quarter or a 12 cent Superman. Uh, da, 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 da. Another 12 cent book there. Another 12 cent book there. It's a bunch of old books. Here's some 35 cent books. And some 65 cent books and some 60 cent books and 75 cents quarter uh, I think that one's a quarter there's a quarter book so just some older books here but now they're all bagged and boarded and ready to go to the auction so nice all right so it is uh, 325 326 and we're heading over to uh, the toy man to buy the rest of his collection, maybe? So for uh, just to buy some more of his collection, I should say. I'm gonna stop saying this is the last of it because every time I say it's the last of it, um, he, he finds more, so. Um, yeah, so let's head back over to the toy man's house and let's see what we can find. Let's go. thousand dollars on toys so um, we just bought three really nice die cast Iron Man hot toys they're selling for like six hundred dollars a piece um, we have three of them so we just spent a thousand dollars and we reloaded up on toys uh, some of these toys though are open and they're not super high dollar they're just toys you know they're they're newer batman type toys uh that have been opened so it's, it's the kind of thing i'll take this stuff out to the auction house and make a couple bucks back on it uh we got um but it's pretty much all batman stuff and then just the three iron man figures uh the three iron man figures is where we'll make our money back and then some of the other batman uh just just regular action figures we'll uh make some money there too hang on one second Right, guys so i got the first box here pretty much unloaded there's some other loose this first box is all loose figures there's still some smaller loose stuff in here um Kylie's gonna take care of that for us so it's a lot of batman stuff of course uh there's one gi joe plane um a couple of just random like uh star wars lego clocks um, Star Trooper, Storm Trooper here. Uh, da, 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 da. Some Spider Man stuff here. Yes, sir. Um, some random Spider Man guys here. This guy here was this Nightwing, I think. Don't quote me on that. I think that's who it is. This Iron Man figure right here, this guy has got some serious weight to him. Uh, this is a 2013 NECA NECA Iron Man. This is close to 100 bucks or so. But that's nice. That will go up on eBay. Buzz Lightyear, 
You know, everything looks just a little bigger with the helmet open. I have a hard job. All right, here's the next batch. So here's some more uh, Batman bicycle, the bat sickles. There's one of those. Here's the bat jet. These are all brand new factory sealed stuff. Um, so there's the bat jet. There's the bat copter. Here is the Batmobile. Factory sealed, never opened. He actually said this is the one um, that has uh, like these were poking kids or pertin kids or something back in the day. And uh, Hasbro had to release um, um, more rounded ones or something like that. And this is the one before um, before they did that. So not really sure not to look that up. But anyway, here's the Batmobile. And uh, there's a bunch of these figures. Uh, Batman and Nightwing. Batman and Superman. Batman vs. Killer Croc. And the sun's starting to go down, so I'm losing my light here. Uh, Batman and Robin. Batman and Joker. And here is another Batman and Superman here. Um, here is a Batman Masterpiece Edition. This opens up. As a remake, that's not the original, obviously. Batman figure. That's a book. So that's cool. Batman and Robin, Toys R Us exclusive. It's uh, wrapped up here, never been opened. And then here's just a random G.I. Joe. Nothing special, just a random G.I. Joe. All right, guys, and before my battery runs out on my GoPro, here's the three hot toys. These guys here, they're die cast. Uh, you can see die cast. And so they're really heavy. Um, and they're, they're quality, uh, as all these things really are. So, you know, here's... Um, Iron Man, it's a Hot Toys MMS 400 D18, if you're keeping track at home there. Um, I think every single one of these are $600 plus pre-owned, maybe $550 or so, but I'll flash the prices up on the screen for each one of these. These things are pretty, pretty badass. There's that one. There's another one. Uh, Sideshow exclusive. MMS 378 D17. I'll flash the price up for that one. And then back here. You have Civil War Captain America, Iron Man. So it's the one from Civil War Captain America, I guess. I never got into Iron Man too much, but I'll flash the price up on the screen for this one as well. And that's it for this trip. Um, thousand bucks was spent, so pretty easy to make that money back. Um, pretty easy to make that money back. That's all I have for you today. Um, tomorrow, or let's see, today's Monday. On Wednesday, I'll be getting 1,500 um, postcards in the mail. 
that I signed up for, um, or that I signed up for, that I got through Vistaprint to use for postcards uh, through the EDDM program with the post office. So uh, I'm going to do a bit of advertising there, and um, I'm going to show you guys how it works and what my results are. Um, hopefully it's going to be good. Never done it before. Hopefully I've designed the postcards right. We're going to see. But uh, I'll show you guys that on Wednesday. So anyway, uh, that's all I got for you. Like, comment, subscribe. Oh, also Wednesday, we're going to go back out to the auction house. So stay tuned for that. And uh, we'll go out and we'll see what our stuff sells for and just what everybody else's stuff sells for. So see you then. Have a good day, guys. Bye.